All right, guys, I butchered my first recording when I showcased this shield on all of my outfits, 287 to be exact. And I'm really bummed about it. The recording is completely butchered. So I went back and favorited all of the uh, actual outfits that I liked when I went through it the first time. And there are some combos here that won't probably look good until you would pair a pickaxe with it. So I'm showing you some pickaxes um, that I favorited that will look really good with the actual shield even though it doesn't really maybe match the outfit itself but i think if you use any of these pickaxes you can get a really good combo and kind of stretch what it actually goes with compared to what you actually own in the game so remember that um like the spell slinger is wood and blue um even batsicle has some blue tape on it obviously the battle axe which it came with permafrost maybe a reckoning an ice scepter um, even the bottom feeder, it's not wood, but it is brown and it's got like a rustic look to it. Even the close shave, it's a very ugly pickaxe, but it's so simple and it could go with the actual runic shield considering what you're actually putting it on. So with that being said, guys, well, let's get sweaty. If I showed you any outfits in this video that got you thinking that maybe this is worth purchasing, then I did my job, guys. So again, Remember, some of these might not look like a perfect match at first, but with an actual pickaxe that contours it, it's going to look really good. And actually, this looks really good with the brown um, dire werewolf stage. It looks good on almost all the furs as well. Um, so, <laughs> literally 20 minutes of circling my outfits. Um, it wasn't a perfect match on all of them. Some of them looked like trash. But I went back on the second time around to actually show you what I think it's going to match with. And this will go the same for the male shield. I don't even remember what it's called. It's a very long name. But we will showcase the male's circular shield on these outfits that we have favorited as well. Assuming you guys want to see that. I'm assuming you want to see it. I don't really like it on the reds. But the blue, obviously, looks pretty damn good. Um, I don't really like it when she's all blue, personally. Maybe something like this I could see going well even the stage one and then we have the black links which looks pretty good as well it looks really good on the black links and i'm really i'm actually excited to show you guys what it looks like on some of these outfits because i was actually really surprised to say the least this is one of those if you have like a wooden pickaxe with blue like the spellbinder it'll look great all of these frozen ones you would i would run something that's like brown or if you have any kind of wooden pickaxe, it'd look really good on those. Let me touch your band manager. Looks good on her, Paracord. Ragnarok, I actually like on a Ragnarok because it doesn't really get in the way too much of his shoulder armor. You kind of think it would, but it's not terrible. Especially on this style, he only has one, one shoulder armor. It's not as bulky. It's, it's a smaller shield size from what we're used to seeing. So if it looks a little lower on the outfits, that is why. It is indeed a smaller shield. We actually compared it in my Before You Buy video to the most common shield in the game, Black Shield, I would say. And it is a little smaller. I don't really like it on this guy, um, but I thought I would show you anyways. Because I know you guys are probably close to unlocking him, so you're probably going to want to see what goes on him. This was surprising. He's got that like a, a lighter shade of brown on his shoulders, but it still looks pretty damn good. Battlehawk, surprising. Um, Great Britain, I liked it because it does have brown and blue, as well as France. The France uh, brown is a little lighter, but nonetheless, it looks really good. And the default Alpine Ace, not bad. Zenith, um, I would go with like a blue visor, and the dark version looks really good. I don't think I don't think anyone can even unlock it yet because it's uh, what is it weekly challenges, I believe. We'll have to wait until I think next week to get Lynx and Zenith. If I'm wrong, then you guys will probably butcher me in the comment section. But I don't think anyone has all black links yet. Maybe if they saved up like weekly challenges to actually turn in. Is that I don't even remember. Is that Lynx or Zenith? I don't I don't recall. Anyways, that looks good. This looks really good. Oh, this looks really good. Looks sick. It just sits right in the pocket of the back right there on her. It looks really cool. Beef Boss. Surprisingly, I like, kind of liked it. I don't know. That's a weird one. Okay, NFL teams. Um, consider the pickaxes, guys. There's a couple good ones here. They're not all bangers. 
The Ravens looks pretty good. I could see it on the Bills. The Panthers as well. The Bears, yes, I like it. The Texans, not bad. Green Bay Packers, no thanks. Detroit Lions, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Um, the Denver Broncos, nah, maybe. Dallas Cowboys, uh, with a wooden pickaxe. The Browns, I do like it with the Browns, but you gotta have something blue, like a permafrost. It wouldn't look terrible. The Bengals, Indianapolis Colts, Jacksonville Jaguars, Kansas City Chiefs, the LA Chargers, the LA Rams, Miami Dolphins, Minnesota Vikings, Pittsburgh Steelers, Philadelphia Eagles fly, Eagles fly, <coughs> I mean die, Eagles die, Raiders, Oakland Raiders, soon to be the Las Vegas Raiders, New York Jets, New York Giants, New Orleans Saints, New England Patriots? I almost said New England the Patriots. San Francisco 49ers. The Seahawks. Seattle Seahawks. Tampa Bay Bucks. Tennessee Titans. Looks good. And the Washington Redskins. A lot of controversy with that name, but we're not going to get into it. Brett Gunner. It's not terrible. I knew you guys wanted to see it, so there it is. Guys, Caster, before I spin it around, guys, sit down, take a seat, take a deep breath. Are you ready? Three, two, one. This looks perfect on Caster. It matches the cut in his jacket, the design. It looks so good on Caster. I was mind blown. Still mind blown. Dante is one of my favorites. It's kind of a stretch. Uh, that's all right. Ah, we gave her some love, guys. We usually don't, but we gave her some love. Dream flower. Now, the gingerbreads. I'm really excited about this, too. We have the non-burnt style, but the burnt looks so good with the dark border of the shield itself. It looks like the shield is also burnt. I think it looks sick. So the burnt edit styles on Mary Marauder and or Ginger Gunner, 10 out of 10. Mogul Master, we showed you the a male, so we showed you the female. We'll get to the other ones shortly. Again, the burnt um, Mary Marauder. I literally, yeah, burnt Mary Marauder. I got tongue twisted there. With the burnt style, looks sick. And the non-burnt, um, I definitely go with the burnt style, personally. Maverick is decent. That looks good. It looks really small on him, but it almost contours with his bulky shoulders. A lot of people are saying that these outfits that just came out are an upgraded Huntress. I can see it, but it looks good on her still. She's got that blue on her face. Looks sick. This looks really good. I like it. One more time. Gumshoe. I actually liked it on her. I just wanted to show you what it looks like on one of the male NFL characters as far as the shoulders go. So there it is. France. Mogul Master. Sick. This looks good. I like it. This is interesting. 50-50. Nah, 50-50 again. You can put anything on this outfit. Powder does have the animated shoulder graphic. So I think it looks pretty good on Powder with a wooden pickaxe. Raps County, you can almost use anything with her. This looks good. I think I... Oh, no, I did show Elite Agent. All right, so we got both of them in there. This is pretty troll. This looks sick. Sinstar. I like it on Sinstar. Call me crazy. Another NFL outfit favorited. There it was. <laughs> uh, with a brown pickaxe, yes. You can put anything on him, most likely. Rosa. Looks good. The manager. I liked it on the manager. I liked it. I don't know. You can put anything on her. That actually looks cool to me. I like the way it looks. Sorry. That looks good. Surprisingly. You can put anything on my man's here. Um, this is what it looks like on the male um, soccer outfits. I'm going to show you it on the female. I have her favorited uh, further down than my list here. You can put anything on her. This looks so good too, man. Both of these. Oh my god. Even this. I don't even know why I didn't comment on it. I was talking about something else. It looks so good. Yes. Maki Master. Sick. It looks so good. With the brown pickaxe, this will look dope. I actually like it on this. I don't know why, but I think it looks pretty good. You just got gnomed. I think this looks really good. Again, I, li I like it on Dazzle. I like it on the color scheme. Right, Bomber? Why not? I don't give her enough love, guys. Brawler. It looks sick on Brawler. I like it with the brown pants. And if you have a blue pickaxe, that's GG. 10 out of 10. 
Um, I liked it better on the female Earhart, but this deal looks pretty good on Maximilian. So all the countries on here, there's some good ones, guys. There's some good ones. Keep in mind the pickaxes, though, for your combos. I like that uniform, but oof, it doesn't look good with that shield. I can see that going. Uh, maybe. There's a lot of red countries as far as like color schemes go. A lot of blues, a lot of reds. Someone asked me the other day on my live stream if I thought there was more color options for the NFL outfits or, or the soccer outfits. And I said, I think you have more color options on the actual NFL outfits. Um... I just feel like there's a lot of reused colors on these soccer outfits. Call me crazy. I mean, you got blues, reds, some greens, um, some yellows. Um, other than that, there's like really no purple other than the default. Um, there's, uh, if we're referring to like NFL outfits, we got teals, bright blues, dark blues, royal blues, greens, yellows, um, maroons, black, silver, I mean, there's, I, I think there's a better color options for the NFL outfits. That's just my opinion, though. The Prodigy looks great with his pants. This looks pretty sick. I like it. Recon Special. She can put a lot on her. Renegade Raider. I know the blue is a stretch, but it looks really good on her. Again, this looks awesome. Almost better than the Royale Shield and the Squire Shield. That looks so good on them. That completely, like, revamps them to me, in my opinion. It looks really good. Commando. Super sweaty combo. Pickaxe, remember. That looks good on Bullseye. That looks super clean. Yes. He has a blue armband. I like it on these. You can put a lot on these outfits. Waypoint. I thought it looked pretty good. Ma Dude, what's his name? I forgot. Sushi Master. I thought Maki Master. Sushi Master looks sick. You can put anything on her. Why not? I like it on Snorkel Ops. Call me crazy. Nog Ops. Sick. I do like this. She's got like a green, a greenish shirt. I like the blue light with it. Uh, this one's like a 50 50 for me, but I kind of still liked it. I like it with the brown. I know it's not a lot of blue, but hey, the pickaxe comes into play. Renegade. You can almost put anything on her as well. It's just all one color. I like it. It looks sick. Scorpion looks really good. This looks awesome with a uh, spellbinder. Again, spellbinder would look sick with this. Wrapping it up with Tower Recon Specialist. Sweaty combo. You can put anything on my mans here. And LeBron James in the Christmas time. Guys, I'm going to give Season 2 some love. And I'm going to say it looked really good on the Royale Knight and the Squire. It looks so good on them, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would actually prefer to do these more than spinning every outfit I own. Because those get very tedious and very boring to create. I hope you can understand. So with that being said, guys, my supported creator, you probably saw it pop up already, is piz 0 within the item shop. You don't have to use me, but please use somebody. And with that being said, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!